Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Earthbound Blind. Last time we went to Onnit and got a meteorite piece uh, for the phase disorder and we got in and check out where the phase disorder took us. Um... Oh, hey. It's the old man. Greetings, so you are finally here. Sweet. Guess we just got healed. Excellent. You are truly excellent. There's only a little time left. I'll give you the last power. I must go. Who became conscious of PSI Starstorm Omega? Oh god, Alpha is already overpowered as crap. How could this power be any greater? Let's check it out before we get in a battle and have to use it. Method of shaking off the stars, well, that's the same as the last one. 720, as opposed to 360, which I believe is like maximum overdrive power. Incredible. So he's going to be able to knock out some major dudes with that one. Let's check the broken phase distorter. There was a horn of life. Broken phase dist- what? Kidnapped. I was doing- boing? <laughs> Keep saying doing. Kidnapper bad guy. Bad guy gone. Zoom. Where? To the past. Ding ding. Okay. F broken phase distorter. Is that the enemy's phase distorter or a different phase distorter? There's a vine. Let's climb it, I guess. Or go down it. I don't know. Wait, what? What do? Um... Oh! Yeah, there's multiple phase disorders. The phase disorder has been completed. We could finish it quickly because of Mr. Saturn's incredible scientific skill. Was it... What? Didn't... Didn't we arrive on the phase... Okay, I'm confused. Whatever. Gygus is attacking from our exact location, but he's attacking from many years in the past. You must warp to the past and fight, but... But what? Also, there's another Mr. Saturn. We here too! Boing! Okay, you say the same thing. Okay, interesting. Well, in that case, let's ride on this face distorter. Or not. Okay, uh... What's happening right now? The phase is... Yeah, this one's still here. Is it... They from different time... Oh! Life up or communicate. We're full HP. Is, Paul, is that Paula's maximum HP? You're kidding. You're kidding! 260! I didn't notice. And of course we can save. We don't really need to save right now. What do we do? I talked to both of them. Can we go on the... The thing now, or... It's very hard for me to tell you, but... Oh, he says something different. In order to defeat Gygus, who is attacking from the past, you must warp to the past. This can be done by way of the Phase Distorter 3. However, the machine cannot warp living things. I mean life forms. Life is demolished in the process of warping. The only way to accomplish this time travel is... to transform your transfer your brain program into a robot and send the robot to the past. The transfer means that your spirit will go to the, with the robot while your body is left behind. I cannot promise that your spirit will come back after the battle in the past. Yet you must understand that the four of you are the chosen ones. Do you still wish to face Gygus by traveling to the past? Nah, man, we're good. No, of course we are. Hmm. You accept this while knowing that you may not be able to return to your current form, right? Yes, I see. You have really set your mind on this. Let me take a good look at you now. Ness, please give me that red cap. Ready? Stand by. So we getting sent to the past now? What? What? I'm not sure what they're doing. He did say send your brain to the past in the robot. Are they actually cutting out our brains? There's no way. These are kids. Like, Ness is like, what, 12? I don't, oh. I'm not sure, um, Pooh Poo is a prince. I'm not sure how old he is, though. Jeez. Ness, Paula, Pooh, Jeff, my son. There's no turning back now. 
Ness, activate the phase disorder 3 by your own hand, thereby following your own destiny. Will you do so? I will indeed. Only a few people know of your amazing courage, but the number of people you saved through that bravery is immense. I feel very fortunate to be present at the beginning of this monumental undertaking. Now we're traveling to the past. Wow, that was quite the animation. Oh, wow. Listen to this music, and yeah, we're robots. Everything's the same. Stubborn items and everything. Oh god, this music's gonna kill me. Enemies! Let's fight them! Ultimate Octobot and... Oh, Nuclear Reactor Robot. Uh, if I remember correctly, didn't the Nuclear Reactor Robot have a PSI shield? Of course. We always have the ability to ch Actually, Paula can crit easy. Let's have uh, Pooh do doing the checking. Go ahead and shed that Heavy Bazooka right there. I think the Heavy Bazooka can only hit... Ooh. And it only costs 42. Ugh. But what if they have a shield? Wouldn't want that to happen. I think I've established the Octobots don't. Okay, yeah, they don't. Look at that! The smash attacks are real, doing more damage than even Ness. And it's healing. Hey, if we could get Pooh to copy that guy, then he could heal himself whenever he needed to. That'd be cool. Um, okay, in this case, let's have everyone do these normal bash attacks. You, of course, use the heavy bazooka. Uh, Pooh, go ahead and send out a Starstorm Omega in their face. Let's see how they like this one. Oh, goodness. Explosions. Oh, that's some... That's some damage. Okay, he explodes. I did not remember that, except we've never fought it before, so I don't know why I would remember it. Well, there you have it. That's a lot of experience points. Paula levels up to 70-whatever that was. Offense, defense, speed, IQ, maximum HP, getting a little bit of everything. <laughs> and a lot of PP. I guess that makes up for a low HP. Then again, we have Ness here. Hey, this is different music. I'm gonna show it. Different background as well. Is this the this is the dude that blew up last time? Let's give him a freeze right in the face. Of course, always using the heavy. I think the heavy bazooka always does more damage than Jeff's normal attack, so I'm gonna always gonna use it. Though I'm not sure if it's dependent on his actual attack power or not. That's what has me stuck. I guess I could give him worse weapons and see if they do better. But I don't know, man. Oh, he's already dead. Oh, because we got a smash attack. <laughs> I wasn't really paying attention there, but... Yeah, the smashes are real. And the enemy left a present. We've got a super bomb, hey! Never going to complain against more super bombs. Uh, question, does super bomb hit the entire enemy party? Because we have quite a few of these. Okay, so it's like the... like the, um... bazooka, basically. Except in item form even though the bazooka is an item form. I feel like the other direction is the way we're supposed to go. Hey, it's a it's a marshmallow. Wild and Wooly Sambler. We saw these enemies in the, or the recolor of these, and unrecolor, I guess, version of these enemies in uh, Winters. Go ahead and attack it. I really wish enemies would start appearing in rows so I could hit them with a fire. That would be really nice. Actually, since it's Wooly, I'm not sure if it'd be resistant to, uh, to ice or not. I don't know, man. Give him the old Star Storm. We don't need to completely annihilate him. Not yet. Save that for when we fight a boss. Well, no, because even then we have ice attacks, so... Freeze attacks, at least. I think it's weird how freeze is, like, the basic attack one enemy with magic attack. Like, specifically freeze. Like, most... Most things have, like, multiple attacks. Like, you can hit everything with a magic attack of any element. I don't know. It's just different, I guess. There's a lot of enemies here. Oh, hey. Okay, so Pooh can heal anyone's HP if he feels like it. Uh, he's, he's transformed into the 
the robot that could heal itself by replenishing its fuel supply. And it also seems like Pooh acts on his own free will when he's doing that as well. So that's interesting. Also, Jeff is dead. We have a Horn of Life. We can use that if we need to. Yeah, see, I didn't have a chance to choose Pooh's attack. That's interesting. Things I didn't know before the final area of the game. Hey, PSI Caramel. Pooh could use that. Well, quick though, let first off, uh, we have a... Do we have a... Do we not have a secret... Did I not buy a secret herb? Or am I just not seeing it? I could have swore to God we had a secret herb. Or maybe Ness used it in auto attack? I don't know. Let's just heal Jeff anyway. Use on Jeff. Good. Now he's not dead. And he has full HP as well. Uh, speaking of HP, let's send out a uh, life up Omega for Paula and Pooh. Uh, yeah, I feel like the other area had an optional path. Hey, I could use that. Get back here. I feel like we missed an optional path back there, but uh, it's really far away to go back with all the enemies. So I think I'll pass up that at the moment. Oh, oh, Squatter Demon. It's a recolor of the of the tent. The tent had an actual sprite, though. I don't think it was just a face. That's cre- No, no, this is the tent, isn't it? Yeah, it is. So it's a recolor of the tent, although I'm not sure what sense it makes for it to be a squatter when it has no legs. Uh, um, let's just hit him with all we got. Hopefully he doesn't have a, a shield, and uh, we win. Uh, go ahead, turn into the enemy, Pooh. I don't like how it takes up one of his turns, though. Like, he doesn't attack if he turns into the enemies that turn. Although, I guess it makes sense. He is resistant to magic. And Paula is asleep. Uh, well, just hit him with all you got. <laughs> just keep doing it. Or maybe no one does that much damage. Maybe Paula just didn't do a lot of damage with that attack. Or maybe it was Jeff. No, it was Paula, because it was a freeze. Whatever. She's not still asleep, is she? Good. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. Hi there. Hey, Ness leveled up to level 86. Not bad. Getting up there in levels. I'm assuming it maxes out at 99. Let's grab the present before they attack us. Legendary Bat. Okay. Well, this, I don't think, is his ultimate equip. But, uh, we didn't end up getting his ultimate equip, which is probably you know, normal, uh, from the area and on it. So I guess we're not getting it. Oh well. Uh, Legendary Bat increases by 20. That is a lot of power. I love it. Guess we're fighting these two as well. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Ghost of Starman here? I'm gonna show this fight, because it's the first time we've seen this combo here. Wow, okay, well, in that case, give him the old Fire Rooney. Although, didn't someone resist it last time? I don't think it was the Starman, so I think we're good. Speaking of which, Heavy Bazooka should be able to hit both of them. I'm going to attack the Starman first because I don't want the other one exploding and killing our entire team. Then again, um, getting rid of that Star Storm Alpha is also a really good thing. And yeah, now they can survive it. Except for Pooh, who was surviving it last time. I mean, they're dead anyway. They're not survive. Okay, they both resist it. Jeez. Yeah. Um, Paul is dead. Uh, actually, no. Give him that. Jeez. Menus are hard. Just attack, because I don't want to die. Oh, you should attack the Starman. Okay, Jeff was at 1 HP. Then again, I guess his guts saved him. We should definitely knock out... Do these Starmen attack the same way every time? I think they do. Because they have, like, the same order in which they do things. They use Star Storm, then they smile, then they count down from three. Great, it did it. We did it. We're the best. Man, I just freaking love it when a healing oh, or healing gamma never works. We'll do it after we kill this guy then, I guess. Even though Paula could probably use the experience. This might take a while as well. Ugh, speaking of which, if we did heal her, we could have Pooh turn into the... You know what? 
You know what? We have the PSI. Oh, Pooh's gonna be faster, though. Although, who cares? Healing on Paula. Pooh, transform into the robot. He could not turn into the robot. Well, we finally got the revive, at the very least. Uh, I kind of want Pooh to get the free the free heal on Paula, just because. Why not? Yikes, he turned into the robot. We did it. Now we just hope the robot doesn't die. He's not going to die. And now we attack with everyone. He's still healing his HP. Okay, not Ness, please. Anyone but Ness, honestly. Oh, there's the crit. There you go. The f we got the free heal on Paula. That's all I wanted in life, actually. How long does this last? For the rest of the battle? Okay, he's dead. And that explosion isn't going to hurt anyone. Easy. That was a really long battle, oh my god. And Paula... Good thing we revived her. Guts, luck, HP, PP. Jeff is also level 69. HP by 3. Not bad. Alright. We'll move on a little farther. Whoa! That is Big Orb. That looks like a boss. Uh, in that case, I'm going to go ahead and end it off right here. Next time, we're going to explore more of this area and see what's up with it. We are in the past as well. So we'll see what comes of it. See you all then, and goodbye.